All right, here we have some old cigarette cards. Ah, Ford Derby. Ain't that neat, huh? They used to put them in the old days. A pack of cigarettes. Let's see what cigarette he. It's all in a plastic bag, then in a plastic casing. Sporting personalities. Oh. Okay. Hmm. Well known in the sporting. Ah, oh, great success as a racehorse breeder. Great. Seventeen of his horses won thirty seven races. Total stakes of twenty one thousand. But that's remember that's back in nineteen thirty three too. Wow. Issued by Gallagher. Virginia House London and Breakfast. Ah Okay, so they're not just cigarettes. Hmm. All right. So we just learned that, didn't we? Oh, look at this one. Playing volleyball. All right. So let's see what this one's all about. Whoops. Well. I can't really tell you. I surely cannot read this writing. But for those of you who can, go ahead. Let us know what it says, huh? You can always leave it in the comment. Well, isn't that something? Mm -hmm. Well, it's card 46. <laughs> Whatever it is, it's card 46. All right, and we have this one here. All right, let's see what we got here. Animal studies. Common inland. Okay, so Central Africa, Southern and Central Africa. Phillips Company. Hmm. All right. Okay, and then, oh, the last little one. Pomeranian. Aren't they the cutest little doggies? Fluffy little things, ain't they? Little fuzzballs. And let's see. The second series issued by Virginia House of London in Belfast. Hmm. All right, kind of like the other one was. Cool. All right. So they don't. Not only the cigarette companies made them, huh? Interesting for sure. All right. Hope you've enjoyed my bringing these to you. Be sure to sub me, join me as a friend. And be sure to share this video with others who collect these tiny little cards. They're interesting little cards. You read all kinds of information about them in the back side. So a little bit of education here. All right. And be sure to also check out the description in this video. So I have three books up for sale. Two are true stories. One was picked up by a screenplay writer and adapted in the screenplay format for producers titled Broken Souls. Very, very fitting for the book and the screenplay. So you're going to want to read that one before the movie comes out. And the other one's a holiday classroom craft for teachers, grades K through 6. You'll find all the ISBN numbers and a little more information about each one of the books right here in the description of this video. So grab those ISBN numbers. You need them to order up the books. So grab the ISBN numbers and get yourself a good read at your favorite book spot. If you're ordering online, Amazon has it. 
All right, everyone. Happy reading, and I appreciate your support. Bye-bye.